Good morning. This week is, uh, on Sunday is December 6th. December 6th is Finnish Independence Day. So last night I baked some bulla and I'm dropping some off at the, uh, at the Finnish consulate here in, uh, here in Halifax. Uh, the Finnish population in Halifax is uh, very, very small and there, there's next to no uh, cultural influence in the area like we had back in Ontario. But, you know, trying to do a little bit anyways, and especially for, uh, for my son, I want to try and, you know, try and carry on a little bit of uh, the, uh, a little bit of the culture and not just, the, not just the food, <laughs> although the food's the best part. But, uh, so we're going to try and do a little bit of uh, Independence Day uh, uh, festivities here in, here in Halifax this week is the 103rd Independence Day of Finland this year on December 6th. We put the uh, flags up on the, our uh, temporary tree until we get a real tree put up in uh, probably next week. We had an invite to uh, take part in the, the virtual celebration of Finnish Independence Day from the embassy in Ottawa. So they did a bit of a virtual uh, uh, get together, which was nice. It was uh, it was really good. They, uh, they had a uh, it was open kind of on uh, uh, the island off of uh, Helsinki and then as you turned around you, there was bubbles you could click on to uh, uh, check out different uh, different videos that they had done up. And then there was a chat box I was able to chat with some of our uh, uh, friends over at the Finnish Embassy and uh, it was nice to nice to chat with them too. So that was, uh, that was really nice to take part in that. Uh, my son and I really enjoyed that. Thank you. Earlier in the week I had a uh, I had been invited to watch a uh, Finnish movie called Hel Helena. Helena, I think it is. It's a, a famous uh, Finnish artist. It was a very beautiful movie, kind of a, a very much a love story. But uh, it was really well done and really nice to see that uh, how life was in that time as well in uh, in Finland. So that was that was nice to watch that. I took some time and uh, I practiced some of my Finnish by listening to some of the YouTube videos that they make with uh, Finnish veterans. I understand a lot. Some of it I had to tr uh, look up and translate just to make sure, but uh, I got, definitely got the story out of all of it. And the things that th that generation went through, I couldn't even imagine. And uh, and and so young as well. And, and not not just the fact that they were they were going to fight a war. It's like they didn't they didn't have to go anywhere to fight the war. The war was there, in their backyards, and uh, and it didn't end with that. Like right? from the Civil War to the Winter War, the Continuation War, then the Lapland War. It was, and then after that, then it was having to rebuild the country, pay war retribu retributions, and and then war debts. That generation deserves so much. They go to these war graves on uh, Independence Day and on Christmas Eve, and they light candles at, uh, at the war graves every year. And uh, I think it's very important that uh, we remember these, uh, these people in that uh, generation and, uh, and remember those stories that they could tell. On Sunday evening on December 6th, you know, I took a nice quiet evening, candles in the window. Traditionally, we light two candles in the, in the window on Finnish Independence Day. And, uh, and I sat back and relaxed and watched, uh, watched the uh, uh, Finnish war movie, Unknown Soldier, uh, which is based on a, a very famous book uh, of the same name, Tultamata on Sotilas. And uh, this was a new rendition that was done. And it's, uh, it's very well done. It's not uh, like your Hollywood war movie where it's uh, so much glamour and big explosions and and uh, people flying through the air it's it's it it does its best not to glamorize war and it's a it's quite a moving story i hope someday to be able to read the entire book and finish but uh it's it's quite a moving story and it kind of gives you an idea on uh, on what uh, what they went through uh, in that time now it's based in the uh, uh continue continuation war so uh about a three, four year period of uh, World War II where they uh, tried to hold their original border against the Soviets.
So that was our Finnish Independence Day here in Halifax. It's an issue that.